Hey, it's your boy Crypto Expat Life back with another video. In this video, we're going to talk about Seed Fi Fund. Now, this is a launchpad token, however, they're launching their NFT uh, side of it, and it's launching uh, what today, I believe, or well, it could be tomorrow by the time you watch this video. And basically, they're going to launch a new token. Now, there's perks to this, and this is getting pushed by you know, a couple of big YouTubers. So, I think it's worth looking at simply because. The price of uh, CDFI is at all-time low, or it's very low compared to what it was, and uh, this is in the bear market, so it's a good opportunity. So let's let's look into it more. I give my thoughts on uh, the project. So let's roll that intro. Let's get into the video. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. You know what to do. Hit that subscribe button and bell notification so when I upload my latest vids. You can get notified immediately. So Cedify is a launchpad token. Um, we did a lot of launchpad tokens, uh, a lot of projects. Probably about, a, probably did at least a hundred, even more, uh, of these um, projects in our Patreon. Now, you probably won't see it on this channel because this channel is only new. I had another channel which had over twenty k subscribers, but I lost access to that channel. Um, but this last what 12 months we've been doing a lot of these uh launchpad tokens so if you're not sure what launch pads are basically they're like a ido platform and they sort of facilitate the the sale they take a cut you need to buy their tokens and then stake it and then how much you stake depends on the level of the tier and then that will get you an allocation of the actual project and uh then you can buy those tokens at an early price. So it's simply like ICOs back in the day, but then now they're sort of getting centralized more. So these platforms like Cedify, they were very, very hot 12 months ago. Very, very hot. And there was a heaps of them. They're still around today, but obviously the bear market, everything's kind of like stopped because there's no point launching the bear market. However, um, Cedify... The, these guys, have, I've been watching them now. I never actually joined Cedify. This is one of the ones that I didn't join because back then it was really expensive. We look at an all-time high of Cedify, it was $16. And you needed like 5,000 of these things to uh, get into it. So for most people, it was, uh, just it was just impractical, right? But now the price has dropped to $2 because of the bear market. This is a good opportunity. And the reason why it's sort of probably maybe gone from like a dollar ninety three to two dollars seven is because they're launching this NFTs, which I'm going to talk about right now. So if you go to their website, cedify.fund, and then click on this SNFTs, they're they're launching their NFTs and they're launching their own token. Now this is getting pushed by uh, Jayna, JYNO Crypto. He's like a trader um, back in the you know when he started been watching him for a while he has some really good information and he's like one of the ambassadors or one of the guys that's pushing this so that's why i'm you know i know the power of youtube and i know that you need like you know like uh ambassadors with big uh channels and alex becker he is also i've watched this guy for a very long time for probably at least five years six years now he he didn't start in the crypto space he started in the um he's an online marketer but he he moved to uh crypto um and nfts in particular and he's got 1.33 million so these two guys i recommend you watch alex becker's channel he's a bit he's a bit of a character but he has some really good information and i think his crypto portfolio is in the hundreds of millions so he's done well with nfts and I didn't know this. I think he's got his own NFT, Neo Tokyo. I think that's his own NFT. Um, so he was obviously shilling that for a very long time. Well, I didn't know it was his um, NFTs. Uh, if I'm wrong, just um, comment below. So, but he has some really good advice. So anyway, Alex and um, this other guy, Jaina Crypto, his name's um, Tony. Uh, they're sort of behind this as kind of like ambassadors. They're going to push this. So that's why I think you should um, really look at this because um, with those guys and just that exposure, this is going to, you know, likely moon the price of this new uh, NFT coin. So you, they're having an airdrop and, um, you know, the, the usual stuff, I mean, there's uh, benefits 
fifty percent reduction in fees with the CFI um, NFT um, marketplace purchase the best games. Um, so you know, obviously they're going to have these games launching when the bear market comes back. Uh, sorry, bear market when the bull market comes back. This is going to come back. All right, they're going to start launching more games, play to earn games. Because that's like what Alex Becker likes a lot, games and stuff and NFTs. And I think, you know, positioning yourself now um, is, is going to be a good opportunity. Because a lot of these launch pads, you know, there's tons of them. Like we're in many of them. Most of them are going to die off, but it's the really good ones are going to stick around. And I think Cedarfly is one of them, even though I wasn't in it. Um, and I watched a lot of the IDOs that they launched. Some of the IDOs that launched on Cedify were on other IDO platforms. I think I was in like ten platforms. So even though you know it wasn't it wasn't practical to get in Cedify at the time because of the high expense, I would still get into the other IDOs because they would launch on multiple uh, launch pads. So that's why I kind of like just didn't um, go into Cedify. It was just uh, too expensive for the average person. But where I see this now with this new launch, they're like kind of innovating. And um, these guys are definitely going to be one uh, of the top NFTs uh, launch pads, if not, if not the top. Uh, you know, with Dow Maker and there's a few others um, in this space moving forward. Because not all these launch pads will survive um, the next bull run, okay? They're just going to drop off, right? Because there's, there's too many of them. So you, how do you get this? You get these NFTs, it talks about the land, and there's gonna be all different uh, perks and all that to the NFTs, right? These are the coins, you can stake it and all that. So how do you get these S NFTs? Well, there's a couple of ways. Let's see how to get it. This is the elig- eligibility, all right? Um, you need to uh, have S fund stakers and farmers during um, the January, February snapshot. So basically you gotta, you can, Go and buy this S fund token, which is cheap right now, in my opinion. Remember, it was sixteen dollars seventy nine, all time high, and that was in the last uh, Bitcoin top, which was exactly around November twenty ninth, two thousand twenty one. Um, yeah, so it done. It's it's basically down eighty seven percent. You can buy this token and stake it. You can stake it, stake the token and uh lock it up basically and or you can get a neo tokyo nft holders so neo tokyo nft holders will get it let's just go to open c let's see what the uh i believe this is alex becker's he keeps on talking about it. i bet you this is his uh actual project now i don't know much about this token okay so yeah i'm just i just found this neo tokyo identities i'm assuming that's part of Neo Tokyo I could be wrong so but basically you just need to hold one of the NFT tokens um, to uh, be eligible so do some more research find the official links uh, if I can find them I'll put them in the description because there's a there must be a couple of different Neo Tokyo to be eligible what's the other one JNR Crypto he's only he's got his own NFTs you can just uh, find the link in the description of one of his videos I think we sh- and then I guess there'll be a link to his uh, NFTs. There it is, the NFT on, on OpenSea. So let's just see what the floor on these ones are. Floor is only 0.83, so it's about a f- well, if my calculation is correct. Uh, never is eleven hundred dollars, twelve hundred dollars, or something like that. Um, for his one of his, so you hold one of his NFTs, you're about to get the. Uh, this is for the airdrop, okay? So you get the airdrop, um, and then. The, obviously, I talked about before the S1 stakers and farmers. Um, the last snapshot was the August the fifteenth, but if you miss that one, there'll be more snapshots in uh, January, February. Okay, and then NFT holders of one of the NFT projects announcing this month. So they're announcing a new one this month, and if you buy one of those, then you'll also be eligible for the um, airdrop. Right, this is for this. Uh, NS, SNFTs, okay, so it's on the it's on the website here under it's under SNFTs and then go claim now claim your SNFTs alright, so when you go claim now 
There you go. SNFTs is coming in uh, 10 days, 27, uh, 37 minutes. You can save this date as well. So that's what you'll get. You'll get this uh, when you when you have either one of these if you're eligible. All right. For one of, any one of these. So, in my opinion, I think I think it's worth just just buying on this one and sitting on it. In fact, it's one of the strategies that uh, I'll be doing um, because we were heavily involved in these launch pads, but obviously it's the bear market. So there's no point doing the launch pads now. The best time to get into these launch pad tokens is when the bear market is because they're all kind of uh, down un- down at the moment. But you want to just get into the, the best ones. You don't want to get into the real like ones that that are going to drop off. You only want, and there's probably, in my opinion, there's probably only five uh, of these to- uh, launch pad tokens. So, it, you know, there's that option there of just buying the token and just holding it. We talk all about all this stuff in our Patreon group as well. I haven't been really talking much about the Patreon group, but um, it's a long-term thing and education-based. We do webinars every uh, week, and it's really long for people that want long-term uh, success in crypto. I'm definitely going to be buying this one, even if I don't participate in the uh, SNFTs, which is this this launch that's going to happen um, by the, the those different NFTs, and then you'll be eligible for this uh, to claim this airdrop. But even just buying this, in my opinion, I think it's a really good um, safe decision. It's just, this is going to be one of the blue chip uh, launch pads moving in the future, and with Alex Becker behind it, and with uh, Tony behind it with uh, JNR Crypto, I think that. It's going to be a really good bet. Obviously, this is just me. This is not financial advice, but it certainly ticks all the boxes, and it's definitely looking good for uh, Cedify. I think they're going to move forward and be one of the powerhouses with launch pads when the bear uh, bear market is over and the bull market comes in. We don't know when that is, but you know, to be honest, now is the time to be buying these tokens because you don't go out and buy a house when the market is at the top. No, you go and buy the house when they're cheap. So why don't people do it in crypto? Because they have this whole mentality that, oh my God, it's the market, you know, the, the coins are down, they're not going to recover. They have a different mindset, right? But you could have the same mindset of when things are cheap, that's when you buy them. Obviously, it's got to be a good house. It's got to be in a good location. It's going to be close to amenities. Uh, it's close to schools, right? You're not going to buy a shit house in a shit neighborhood. No, you're going to buy... Uh, a good house or a relatively undervalued house in a good neighborhood and that's what i think cedify is you're, you're buying a good project that's undervalued right now because of the market all right guys thanks for watching uh please subscribe and hit that share button youtube are doing funny things i don't know what's going on but um if you do those things that will really help the channel really appreciate it and i'll see you guys in the next video Hey guys, 